Hey you guys, it's Gaga Man. I love you playing the video. So today's video is going to be a very, very, very tiny haul. Hope the music isn't too loud. And plus I have my fan on directly next to me because it's hot in my room. So yeah. So today's gonna be a really tiny like quarantine haul. Some things that I've bought for myself while in quarantine. And yeah, I'm going to do an outfit of the day because I got kind of dressed up a little bit. Not really. And like a little update and stuff. So yeah, we're going to get started. So I'll start off with the outfit first. have on my Sweet Heat bandana. Then I have on my Adidas face mask. It's handmade. This is also a part of the haul, so I'm not going to go into details about it yet. So I have on my dead inside choker black and white with a red skull i made this for myself if you guys want to buy any jewelry by me like any custom jewelry or any jewelry that's already available you could check out my instagram page i'll have a link in my description you could go over there and check out stuff if you want to i've been making um some new stuff because i got new beads recently these are some of the new beads and the skull beads so yeah then I have on like my, I call it like my ex or Billie Eilish inspired chain. I mean, I just took a piece of chain and made it like that. And then I put my handcuff keychain at the end. I did that before, but then I ended up taking this off and using it as a keychain for pants. But I put it on, put it back on here. Then I have on my Zolitas, a coat of girl necklace. You guys know I fucking love Zolitas. So yeah. Then I have on some bracelets that I made. This one is new. Hope you can see it. It says Best Friend. It's inspired by King Princess song Best Friend. It's literally playing in the background. I don't know if you can hear it, but yeah. I have a pot leaf on it because I also wanted to do a pot leaf inspired bracelet for myself. So I was like, I could just incorporate it into the Best Friend bracelet that I'm making that's dedicated to King Princess song Best Friend. So I was like, I could put it on here. And then I have a green skull. I think it was really cute. Then it's just all black. Then I have on my marina bracelet and my disturbed bracelet with like the chains. It's really cool. Then I have on my daddy bracelet. I was going to keep it for myself, but I don't like how big it is. So I'm going to give this one away to whoever buys my um, daddy choker that I made that I put up for grabs literally a couple of hours ago. I'll show you. You guys know I keep like more bracelets and stuff in a little bag. I hope I'm not talking too well, but this is the daddy choker. If you can see that. It says daddy and it has the it has two pastel pink skull beads and it's just black and like neon pink. It's so pretty. Like so that's so I'm like whoever buys this choker will get the daddy bracelet to match it for free. The choker is seven dollars plus shipping. Shipping starts at three dollars and eighty cents so yeah if you guys want to crop it just let me know you can comment below or just go to my instagram page and dm me that way so you could buy it because that would be like the easiest way so yeah then i have on my black craft um sweater dress haven't worn this in a long time but then on the hood let me show you it just says black craft going across of it i believe this is a small i can't remember but yeah, and it has like the lace-up details. I should get on this thing. Ooh. I just like putting on my middle finger. It's nothing to you guys. So it has the lace-up. It's um pretty long. It's not too short. I'm trying to like... Because I'm not trying to fall off of this thing real quick. So. Ooh, I shouldn't have... That's better. So yeah, then it has like the lace-ups on the side. And it just has like the black craft coat symbol. I got this sweater dress from Hot Topic, I think, two years ago. Yeah, I got this like two years ago. So yeah, it's really cute. So that's the outfit. Then I just have on my slide. They say card on them. I got these from eBay for $10. So yeah, and then I, as you guys can tell, I cut my nails and I painted them. I did this yesterday. I love how they turned out. 
Honestly, I did not. Um, my sister cut my toenails today and I painted them. I don't know. I will show you, but I don't know about that. But anyways, we're going to get to the haul. So we're going to start off with the face mask first. So I'm going to try to get a little high up so you can see me. God, I hope I don't fall. But yeah, I got this Adidas face mask from my cousin. She has like her own um small business she makes bonded so i can't make bonded so then she recently started making masks so i have put in an order to get one they're ten dollars so yeah i got to do this one i really love it i just don't like that i told her to make it a little bit smaller because i saw it on like other people and it looked kind of big like my face is tiny so i was like oh my face is small for you well, are the masks are big or small and she was like oh they're all one size fit all but she's like i'll make it a little bit smaller for you if you want i'm like yeah can you do that i should have never did that but i still love this mask i just don't like it doesn't cover my nose or if it if i want it to this part will be showing and i don't like that i'm just really particular about certain things so next time if i end up buying another mask from her I'm just going to keep it um, at one size fit all because that would have been perfect. It would have covered my nose and covered this bottom part of my chin. But I really love this mask so much. Like I'm definitely going to still wear it and like when I do like different fits and stuff. So even if I don't wear it outside, I might still wear it outside. But it won't be like the number one thing I'll wear because like it doesn't cover my nose unless I want this part of my face like halfway showing. But yeah, this is a dope ass mask. Like I love it. So yeah, it was ten dollars. This is why I don't wear dresses. But yeah, it was ten bucks, and I feel like I think that's a reasonable price. And it's really nice. And my hair is still on a bun. I need to get my hair done, but I'm gonna get it done after quarantine. So now we're on to the other one. So I got this crystal necklace and crystal choker set so i'm gonna like um link everyone's stuff in the description down below like for example i'll link my um cousin instagram if you want to go buy a mask from her so then i'll link you to the girl that i got this set from it was only five dollars she was doing a sale on her um story and i was like oh because i really wanted a crystal or a resin crystal necklace hope you can see that but yeah so I was like, oh, it's only $5 and you get the tattoo choker one with it because it's like a set. So I was like, hell yeah. And I love buying stuff from her. Like I get a lot of my resin pieces from her that I use in like my jewelry. So like her stuff is really good quality. So it's really nice. I didn't wear this one yet, but I did wear this a couple of times and I wear like my, when I was wearing like my really bright theme outfits or whatever, but yeah. I'll link her um, Instagram in the description. And then the last but not least, I got my crybaby butter from this girl that I follow on Instagram. She recently started making these. These are um, handmade and they are used to like for your face. So I actually put some on. I don't know if you can see like the glow, but I just had this mask on. So it probably like soaked it up a little bit, but it has your face. It be having my face glowing and we be looking amazing. So yeah, like I love it. It's so nice. It was $20 and includes shipping and like her packaging is so cute. And you only have to use a little bit, like a little bit does go a long way. Like she said, like I only use a little bit and I still have so much left and i love her packaging how she does like the teardrops and it smells really nice uh I, this one is called the fairy butter because she has another one that's called the peach butter and that one is 25 dollars because i forgot she used like um some form of like peach stuff that's really good for your skin so that one is just five dollars more but this one is only 20 like i said includes shipping and everything i'll link you to her instagram she will be restocking on these the peach ones and she's bringing out toner and body butter as well and she said those are really geared to people that have tattoos but like it's for everybody but like people with tattoos it's like it'll be even better for you guys to make sure like 
your tattoos are like staying fresh and looking dope and not like dulling out and stuff and she says she's selling those for $45 and you get like an 8 ounce container of it so that's a really good deal then her toners are going to be $10 I'm definitely going to try to crop one but yeah like it's these are you let me get the note that she needs on. so this is used to like moisturize your face so like after you um, cleanse your face, you tone it, then you put this on. Especially, especially really good for people that wear makeup as well, to make sure to keep your face hydrated and stuff. But really good for people that like have dry skin. Like for me, example, I have dry skin, so this is really good for me. It keeps my skin glowing, and it looks really good, and it works really well. But I just need to start um, washing my face properly because you're not supposed to only put water. On your face you're supposed to actually use like a face wash product to wash your face but I don't have that right now and I don't have toner so I just been doing what I've been doing and it still works it works perfectly fine for me but I still want to do it the correct way to get an even better result for my skin to look even more better so yeah like I still have like little bits of breakouts when I start doing it properly and stuff it will help even more than what is helping right now Cause like I see a difference in my skin, like it really does help it. And like when I was getting pimples and stuff when I was wearing it, it will like help the pimples go away, so I don't have to like you know pop them and stuff. But you sh you guys should crop one. She's really sweet and she puts such hard work into them, and they are worth the twenty dollars to get them. Like I got this like I think it was like two weeks ago, and I still have so much left. Like when she says a little go a long way, she actually means it. So this is her um note. So, I'll it to you. so her brand is called Baby um, Cry Baby Butter. So it says, thanks for your purchase. Remember, a little goes a long way. Don't forget your steps, cleanse, tone, moisturize with your butter. Don't forget to post up that, what does it say? Oh, buttery skin, hashtag, hashtag Cry Baby Butter, enjoy XOXO. I love her handwriting. It's so cute. Wait, this is the note that came with it. I put it over here in my little art section. Oh yeah, like that was like my really small haul. I didn't I haven't been buying too much for myself because you know quarantine. Let me like get back up. So I've been trying to only buy stuff that like I really need and I really need like really good fish moisturizer because I've been using what is it called? Aveeno um lotion and I think that's only is only supposed to be used for your body well you can still use it for your face but it's meant to really use on your own body and it also dries out my face even when i wear it and compared to wearing her stuff my face don't be dry like it'd be really smooth and it'd be glowing so that's why i'm just like i mean it will only like get dry you know after i literally put it on then i put on a bandana and a face mask and it's going to soak it up because it is an oil based product so it's not I mean, you can still wear it, but it's meant for you to wear and let your skin breathe instead of, like, having it covered up right after you put it on. But it's okay. For me, it's fine. Like, days, because I don't have on a mask and, and um, bandana all the time. I just have it on once in a while from, like, going outside and stuff. So, when I'm in the house, I don't have it on. So, like, my skin just be, it'd be amazing with her stuff. Like, her stuff is really good. You guys should check her out. But, yeah, um, I also ordered, um a spike choker from um ebay but that's not gonna get here until like next month because i got it from china it only was like two dollars i think and it's just a black simple one with like the short um silver spikes so i can't include that but i don't know i might end up ordering some more stuff as quarantine goes along but i'll see right now i haven't bought anything else so this is just the stuff that i have recently bought and like the other stuff I bought is for my jewelry business. So I'm going to be doing a video right after this one for that channel. So if you want to see all the beads that I bought for my jewelry business, then you could go over there and check out that video. Especially when it's done, I'll like link it in the comments so you guys can go watch it. So I'm going to show you guys the choker. So the choker was $1.99 plus $0.30 cent shipping. I'm going to have to show you guys the picture.
Not so well in quarantine. Why is it not open? I'm gonna just show you a picture from her. I have tie dyed my Zolita um, Explosion shirt. Cause I, I think I told you guys that it had got stains on it and it wouldn't come out when I would wash it. So I was like, I don't wanna like cut it up into a back patch or cut off the sleeves cause I really like how this shirt is already. So I was like, oh, I could tie dye it. Cause I ended up, when I was cleaning out my closet, I've noticed that I still had tie-dye left, so I was like, oh, I could tie-dye it. So I did, and it came out amazing. I'm going to show you. So, that's the black choker that I ordered. So, yeah. That won't be coming until, like, next month. But yeah, I'm about to show you the, um, Zolita shirt. So I ended up tie-dyeing three shirts because I had a lot of tie-dye left and I still have some left but the main shirt I wanted to um, tie-dye was the Zolita one I love how this shirt turned out like yo it looks amazing look at that that is pure art I love it I love it so much and Zolita even liked it because I had tagged her when I posted it on my um my clothing brand um page she loved how it turned out like it looks even badass from before i even bought it like because it was just a plain white shirt i still loved it just all white because it went really well with the outfits i was doing with it but now i would just have to figure out i think this would look really cute with um like really distressed mom jeans um like light washed um denim mom jeans yo with this shirt it would look fucking badass I'm gonna have to look in to try to find some. But yeah, I love how this shirt turned out. And then I tie-dyed this one. Because it was like really dingy. It was just an all-white shirt. I really like how it turned out though. This one is, it kind of, um, gave me like alien vibes. So, that was really cool. Then I liked how this one turned out. I feel like this one will look even better as a muscle tank. So I might be cutting off the sleeve soon. It says, Committed to succeed. I said committed to succeed. Committed to success. It is succeed. I'm retarded. You guys know what I mean. I be overthinking shit too much. But yeah. I had got this from when I was in high school. They gave us these when we graduated. It was just all white. It, I didn't like it. And I didn't really wear it. I only wore it like a couple of times to like sleep in. And I still do. But I really like how it turned out with the tie-dye. I feel like I'll wear it more. And especially when I cut the sleeves off, this will be a badass shirt. So, those are the three shirts. And that's pretty much everything, I think. Um, yeah. What have you guys been doing in quarantine? And I love how this video was only had, like, how many things I had to show? Like, four things that I bought. And it's still 18 minutes. I talk too much. I'm sorry. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know what was your favorite and what other types of videos you would like to see. Like, comment, subscribe, share all of your friends. I love you guys. Thank you for always watching my videos and supporting me and going to like my Instagram pages and follow me. I really appreciate it. I hope you guys are doing well. And I'm going to talk to you guys later. Leave a comment below. Let me know how you're doing and what you want to see next. So. I'm going to talk to you guys later, and I'm going to go make the other video. And that video is going to be long, too, but... Oh, well. Alright, peace out.